Ha ha ha. This is me going up the hill. Okay. I'm walking in the sun, so I have my glasses on. You can see little bits of sweat. So this is my second trek up the hill. And let's see what happens. So most likely I'll be ditching my coat, um, tying it around my waist when I get to the base, since I need to do this twice um, to get my body accustomed to getting back into it. And then I'll be back this afternoon around three for another two and since I have already stretched for the day when I'm done I'll do a stretch again and that will be really nice so that little stretch will tell me so I can take it off so this is what I look like when I'm coming up the hill it's not a lot of fun it's it's good though because you're pushing your heart to work and we've been stagnant all winter and so, and you keep your weight down by doing this. You can talk, you can always do this, then go to the lake and sit and write, which I do that sometimes. I do it twice. And then I go down to the lake to sit, to write. So I'm at the base of the hill, Trucker's Hill, and I'm coming up Trucker's Hill. And so, I guess that guy must be absent him again. So most likely, he maybe just comes to the base and go up. So I'm going to go up. There's a lady coming down. So you can see what it's like. It's a biker ahead of me and stuff like that. So we truck has healed twice. And you strengthen the muscles doing that. If you're lean and you're skinny, can do like the man here and ride your bike and stuff so I'll do Trucker's Hill twice and then I'll go home oh yeah he's a black guy I guess he's not done he's actually he's going through the gilding so he must be finished and see the sun is behind me so I don't need my glasses but because it's above me or something, it's creating that haze. So this man is riding his bike up the hill. I am not. <laughs> I'm just going to walk up, get to the top, come back down and do it again. So it looks like he's going to go through the shortcut so he doesn't have to go up the hill. It's not nice. So he's doing the shortcut. I am not. I'm beast. I'm a Trojan. So I'm going to do it that way. And so, so that's what I'm going to do. Because so I'll do it twice. And then next week I'll do it three times. And then next week I'll do it four times. Hello. And next week I'll do it five times. And then I'll be doing it five times every day. Seven days a week. If the weather is good and you'll see the difference because you lose all that winter fat that you gain although they say I don't but it just tones things up so I'm at the I'm in the center of the hill so listen to my breathing but there are people and there was a time if you don't stay active you won't be able to do it I am not in pain, I'm just short of breath a little because I'm talking to you and that's good too because you're supposed to have a conversation, be able to have a conversation while you're exercising. So this is it, I'm still going up, almost at the summit, not at the summit, still it's winding too. So there we go. And <laughs> here I am. So it's still, remember where I started? At the top, I'm going to get there. Then I'll stop this video, tie my sweater around my hip, put my phone away and do the rest so I can have it under my belt. Persistence, determination and focus. If you want to stretch your stuff in the summer, 
pick an exercise program. If you want to stretch yourself for the summer and you want to wear clothes that you want to show off your body, pick an exercise program. Don't let your belly be hanging out. Don't do that. If it's going to be like that, go do some sit-ups, come down to the lake and do what I do, go up and down all the time. And you'll see a huge difference in a month, not even a month, a week. <laughs> you'll start seeing your clothes are falling off. You'll be more thirsty, you'll drink more water and you'll feel fabulous. So I am approaching the summit right to the top of the hill and here we are so that's where i started so tessa out the girl is here and there she is so what are you doing for yourself today i know i did something and here we are so that's it <laughs>